hello, hello, friends. This morning we are making some special tea. Can you guess from the footage that you saw what kind of tea it is? Okay, I won't give you too much time to guess. I'll just get right on into it. It's fever grass tea. Fever grass tea or lemongrass tea as it is called in some other places of the world. Yerba de limon in Latin America. So this tea is quite, quite famous. And this morning I'm just gonna show you very quickly how to make it. I have some lemongrass blades that I've already prepared. I've washed them thoroughly and tied it up in a little knot. Place it in my teapot and I'm going to just pour some boiling water on it. Water that is, you know, fully boiling because sometimes you can put it into the pot to boil a little on low, low flame or on the low heat so that it doesn't boil out too much and then, you know, you lose the flavor. So I'm going to pour it onto it. I choose to pour it onto it. As I mentioned just now, you can just boil it in the pot for a little bit. Now I'm going to just add the water to it. There you see the water fully boiling. I'm going to just turn off the stove now and pour it onto my tea. to be careful with that hot water. Great, wow, and the moment the hot water hits it, you can just smell that lovely aroma, wow. Mmm, you should be here in my kitchen to smell this. Wow, now what I'm gonna do is cover it very quickly so that it can just steep for about 10 minutes while I get some other stuff sorted out and then I'll be back with you very shortly. Well, now here we are and this should be ready to go. Wow, smell that fever grass. This smell is so very strong, you know. It's very, very strong. Yes, it's ready now. It's ready. It's ready for pouring and making my tea. Now, you know, in Jamaica and I guess across the world too, Fever grass has been said to have many benefits, but in Jamaica, you know, as you have a little fever, they say, oh, drink some fever grass. And in Jamaica also, we like to have tea for every little thing. As you have a little headache, a little stomach discomfort, tea. Your grandma will say, you need some tea, maybe it's gas. But in this case, I don't have any of those complaints. We're just gonna go right ahead and have it just for pleasure, just for the sake of having some tea. I am going to strain this off right now, because just in case there's any little Thing that came off on the leaves they were thoroughly washed but I still want to just strain it off so that I ensure I capture any little thing that might have been caught on the leaf that's it it's ready now look at that light green color you see that that's how your lemongrass should look not brown if it's brown it's overboiled right and this tea you can have it with sugar if you want or honey or you can have it just as it is in my case, I choose to have it with some honey, real Jamaican honey I'm going to have with this tea. I'm going to put just a little bit in it to flavor it because you don't want it to get too sweet and to drown out the flavor of the lemongrass. So I'm just putting a little bit in it. Yes, there you see, just a little bit. Wow, then I'm going to just sit right here at my tea corner and enjoy that. I hope you enjoyed this video. Tell me if you've ever had this tea before or what uses you've heard that it can be good for, or you know, tell me what your experience is with it, if you've had any experience with it. I'm ready to have my tea now. Bye guys. Thank you very much for watching. Remember to like, share, subscribe, and comment. Thank you. Bye.